Hi, we're researchers here over the summer with the Yurska program, and we're doing zebrafish models of MS. I'm Kate. I'm going to be a sophomore. I'm majoring in neuroscience and chemistry. And a fun fact about zebrafish is that they've been sent to space. Hi, I'm Eunice. Uh, I'm going to be a senior. Um, I'm majoring in neuroscience. And a fun fact about zebrafish is that they can lay transparent eggs, which is great because you can manipulate them. Hi, I'm Brooke. Um, I'm going to be a junior next year. I'm majoring in neuroscience and minoring in psychology. Um, a fun fact about zebrafish is that they get their names from their stripes on their body that resemble zebras. So Richmond refers to factors that affect the behavior of the fish that could be the natural habitat we're trying to mimic here or in the other room we have two tanks similar to these ones set up that we're continuously playing music to see how Richmond affects their behavior. So stress is one of the behaviors that are exhibited by patients carrying uh, multiple sclerosis. Uh, and that is why we're trying to reduce it using enrichment. Multiple sclerosis is a um, neurodegenerative disease that affects the central nervous system and can result in loss of vision, numbness, and several other. So, our first trial is when we put the fish in an empty tank to see a novel tank test. And here, using a division, we'll track how long it's spent um, either at the bottom or the top, where the bottom will demonstrate that it's more anxious, while the top will show less anxiety. Here is the tracking. The red dot goes along with the fish. So our second test is the novel object test. So after we do the novel tank, immediately we put two of the same objects in. This is it, to see if the fish just get familiar with the objects. Once we take that out, we leave it in there, then nothing with the objects in for a minute, and then we put a new object in, which is called a novel object, and then familiar, and see if they recognize the new object. This will affect MS as when they have MS symptoms, they won't be able to see as well, and they will, won't move as well. But with enrichment, we hope that their stress and their mobility will be better.